I'm Justin St. Clair at Within the Within, and welcome to this Loving Your Inner Child meditation. Many of us have an inner child that has been neglected, stifled, and unloved. This rejection of self creates suffering, anxiety, and often disease. Many of our inherent gifts lie within these lost or repressed fragments. They yearn to return home to self-acceptance and love, and we long to welcome them so that we might experience our wholeness. In this meditation, we will bring home those fragmented, lost parts of self and create a more loving connection to our inner child. Because the world of our inner child was defined by our caregivers, parents and guardians will feature in this meditation. Bear in mind that you can do this meditation as many times as you like, using it whenever a need to reconnect or heal arises. You may also stop this meditation at any point by simply opening your eyes and coming back into the room. Now go ahead and get comfortable. Sit or lie down in a place where you won't be disturbed. Close your eyes and relax. Together we call on the Archangel Michael for guidance and protection. The symbol of the Archangel Michael is a sword of light and his energy is a beautiful royal blue or indigo fire. Allow that fire to surround you, filling your space, clearing any negative energies, entities, or thought forms, and closing any negative portals. Let the indigo fire permeate your body, filling you with a sense of peace and warmth. Take a deep breath and give your body and mind permission to let go. Be mindful of where your body touches the surface beneath you. Feel the pressure at the different points of contact. Now let your attention move to your scalp and allow it to completely let go. Move your attention to your forehead and let it relax. Feel your temples and eyebrows soften. Allow the four corners of your eyes to relax and feel your eyes sinking deep into your head. Permit all the muscles around your nose and mouth to relax. Your cheeks let go as your jaw softens. Now let your tongue relax. Feel the relaxation moving down your neck and into the shoulders. Allow that warmth to move into the upper arms, softening the muscles, then into the elbows, relaxing the lower arms. Finally, the fingers. Feel the relaxation and warmth moving down your upper back into your middle back. Lower back and sacral. Feel all your back muscles become heavy.
Take a deep breath and let your chest relax. The relaxation moves into your abdomen and pelvis. Your hips open and soften and your genitals relax. The thigh muscles let go as the relaxation moves into the knees, lower legs, ankles, and feet. Now let your internal organs relax. Your skin relaxes. Feel your entire body letting go. Together, let us now call on the Archangel Gabriel, angel of water and emotions, whose symbol is a silver chalice. Gabriel's energy is copper light or diamond white fire. Gabriel helps us heal emotional trauma and watches over all children, including our inner child. Feel Gabriel's warmth and fire surround you. Know that you have an angel on either side of you, Michael on one side and Gabriel on the other. A magnificent light begins to shine down upon you. As the light brightens, it forms a luminous pillar that envelops you. This is the light of your higher self, connecting you to your deepest wisdom and to source energy. In front of you, there is a beautiful pond. The surface of the water is still and reflective. On the other side of the pond, you see a child of about four or five years old. You recognize yourself. This is your inner child. You notice what the child is wearing, their hair and face, and if they have anything with them, like a toy or blanket. Without thinking, you float across the beautiful pond to them. Standing beside them, you look into their eyes and smile. And together, you both look onto the surface of the water and see yourselves reflected there. You become aware that much has transpired and that many parts of yourself are missing. Let us journey back in time to before you were born. Observe yourself in spirit form, standing before a large screen on the screen, you see various individuals going about their lives. You notice their circumstances and the quality of their experiences. As you watch the different people, you recognize your guardians or parents. You realize that this is the moment you chose them knowing that they would be the most fitting individuals to assist your soul's evolution in this lifetime. 
you can see their strengths and weaknesses would challenge and inspire you to move through life. Again, become aware of Archangels Gabriel and Michael. You allow yourself to experience whatever emotions arise in this moment, knowing that you are safe and supported. Breathe and feel the angelic copper and indigo fire surrounding you, entering your heart, your solar plexus, and your mind. Feel these warm fires transmuting any discordant emotions into the pink flame of acceptance. And breathe. Now move forward to your time in the womb. You can see warm, dark shades of red and hear the deep rhythmic beating of a heart. You feel safe, held, and unity with the being around you. There is a wondrous feeling of love and a deep sense of peace. falling sensation and intense pressures now bring you to the time of your birth. You have just come into the world. The light is bright and the air is cold and you may be crying. See your face, your tiny hands and feet. Marvel at the miracle of your birth. Know that you have your whole life ahead of you and love that baby. Love that tiny little baby. And surround the baby you with a beautiful pink radiance. Feel the warmth and unconditional love of this pink flame. And breathe. See yourself the very first time your parent or guardian left you in a school or daycare environment. You may not have wanted to leave them, or you may have been excited to stay. Whether you cried for your guardian or made new friends right away, love that child, adore that child and envelop them in a sublime pink glow and breathe. Remember the time you were just entering adolescence. Your body may have been going through all the changes of puberty it may have been confusing and difficult, or it may have been exciting and liberating. Perhaps you felt awkward, scared, or exhilarated. And love that version of you. Open your heart and hold that teenager with love as you surround them in a glorious pink light and breathe. Think of the time you got your first job or were given your first big responsibility. Remember how it felt to be trusted and what it was like to earn money and to be acknowledged. Notice any judgments you may have had about your performance or the circumstances of the situation at that time. 
Having grown since then, how do you feel about that experience now? And love that version of you. Love that version of you as the beautiful pink radiance suffuses that memory. And breathe. to the first time your heart was broken. You may have been rejected in love, or you may have lost a loved one. It was such a difficult experience, and you may have wondered if and how you would ever love again. So love that part of you. Love that part of you. And with the support of Gabriel and Michael, feel the deep compassion in your heart that you have for you. Engulf yourself in the divine pink flame and breathe. Take yourself to another milestone in your life. Trust that whatever comes up is ready to be seen. It may have been a challenging time, or it may have been a wonderful time. See yourself living through that experience. And love yourself. Love yourself. Once again, cover the scene with healing pink light and breathe. Now, you find yourself back at the edge of the pond with your inner child of four or five. Your younger self is beaming up at you. Ask your inner child if they want to say anything to you. Do they have a message for you? As you lean in, they whisper in your ear. Listen carefully to what they have to say. Take it in fully. Thank your inner child. Look into their eyes and say, I am so sorry I haven't been there for you. I love you with all of my heart and I am here for you now and forevermore. Hug your inner child. Feel the love you have for them and they for you. Holding them, you notice the reflection on the surface of the pond. To your delight, you see all of yourselves standing around you. They are all smiling. The Archangels Gabriel and Michael appear behind the group, shining brilliantly. Across the pond, you notice the pillar of light that represents your higher self. In that light, a person appears. You recognize them immediately. As they float across the water, they say, I am your future self, and I have come to love you. As they draw near, you see the familiar shape of your face. This future self offers their arms and you embrace 
feeling loved, held, and safe. The sublime light of your higher self surrounds you now. It grows brighter and brighter until all you are aware of is his light. Angels Michael and Gabriel. Become aware of your body once more. Wiggle your toes and your fingers. And in your own timing, open your eyes. Coming back into the room. Thank you for joining this Loving Your Inner Child meditation. If you enjoyed this content, hit the like button, share, and subscribe below.